What's up sisters? Today I'm doing an oldie but goodie hair tutorial and I'm using some of my faves from Curls Blueberry Bliss Collection. Formulated with organic blueberry extract which are packed with antioxidants and vitamins such as vitamin A, C, E, and B complex. This helps protect color treated hair and stop breakage and also helps speed up hair growth. This style is a remake of my very first YouTube hair tutorial back in 2009 during the Shea Coco Love days. I used to call it the Shea Hawk, hinting that it almost looks like a mohawk. Thumbs up if you've been rocking with us since then, and thumbs up if you're just joining the journey. Welcome to the sisterhood, and thanks for following. As you can see, I start off with fresh, clean, wet hair. I'm spraying my hair with water, and then I'm applying some argan oil to seal in the moisture. Ah, oh, lens check. Look at that. All the way up the collarbone. It's growing, y'all. My hair is parted into six sections, three in the front and three in the back. After applying my oil and making sure my hair is detangled, I'm using Curls Blueberry Bliss Repetitive Leave-In Conditioner. Now this leave-in is the truth. It is excellent for moisturizing and repairing dry damaged hair. I apply this product from root to end so I can reap the benefits of those blueberry antioxidants. This Curls product smells so good, it fills the room and I always get compliments when I'm out in public after I used it. It smells just like blueberries. I'm going to two strand twist all of the back sections and I'm going to do them small to get a more defined look. I'm going to be using Curls Blueberry Bliss Twist and Shout Cream. I really like the styling product. It works well with my dry kinky hair type. It adds great shine to it. It also moisturizes really well and softens my hair. And I would say it has a gentle hold for a great controlled twist out. So I'm applying this product from root to end on my two strand twist. A two strand twist is pretty simple these days. It's just twisting the strands as you twist them around each other. And I'm gonna do this all the way to the end. For two strand twist outs, if you want a more defined look, do them smaller. If you want a more fluffier, chunky twist out look, do them bigger. And I've been hanging on to them big ones lately. I haven't done a small twist out in a very, very long time. Once I finish the back section of my head, I'm going to also apply the same process to the front section, which applying my argan oil, and then I'm gonna apply the leave-in, and then the twist and shout cream. I am using a Denman brush, and what this does is it helps me curl my ends more, and it's gonna help me pull apart my twist more easily once my hair dries. Once I'm done twisting the middle section, I usually flat twist or have my mom braid the side of my hair, Today I'm going to be doing two strand flat twists which I'm not really good at so I'm going to show you how I do it but you may want to watch one of Tony Updo two strand <laughs> flat twist videos but I usually just um, go ahead and separate my hair into small parts all the way down and then um, I really don't know how to explain it but you grab as you go and you twist. So I usually have the hair um, a strand above my index finger and then the other strand in between my thumb finger and index finger and I just twist as I go twist as I go I'm not really good at this but it secures the hair down and it keeps it in place like I want it to I twist all the way down to the end and I usually do about three strands on the side so you can corn roll flat twist or anything that you want now I'm going to lay my edges down with the blueberry bliss curl control paste. I love this stuff. You know, I love slicking my edges down and this has great control. It's enriched with hydrogenated castor oil with certified organic blueberry extract to purify the scalp and also stimulate for growth along the edges. Once you're finished twisting, you can wear it as it is and let it air dry. Um, it's a great two-in-one style, but you can keep it in your twist for a couple of days, even for a week if you want to and then take it down. Um, I usually pin up the flat twist with bobby pins. As you see, um, I just twist them together and bobby pin them to the middle of my head. And if the front of my hair is too long, I usually just take two of the strands in the front, twist them together and bobby pin them in place as well to keep the hair from bouncing in my eyes and stuff. I wear this protective style for about a two or three days and then I do the takedown. Um, my hair is still moisturized, um, very, very soft from using a twist and shout cream by Curls. Um, I'm going to pull each strand apart only once to um, not cause too much frizz, but the product um, gives a great hold and my 
twist style I believe came out pretty defined and you can see the nice sheen from the um, twist and shout cream um, avoid pulling your twist apart too many times um, you want to try to keep that defined look for the twist but once you're done pulling them apart it is okay to fluff out the roots of your hair to get more volume try not to go uh, full blown fro or chunky twist out because I tend to do that sometimes it just end up picking it all the way out into a fro but this time I'm being very very um, gentle with the pick and just fluffing out the roots and once I'm finished fluffing that is it and to keep the hairstyle just retwisted um, you can do big twists at night and it'll still be defined once you pull them out in the morning. This game changing curls collection is available at select Target and Sally Beauty Supply stores and curls.biz. Like and subscribe to our social media pages and check out our latest videos. Thanks for watching. Peace out, sisters.